city of Rockland says you can stop calling it about the nonstop sprinklers running at one of its soccer fields. City leaders promise that what it's doing to these fields will actually, in the long run, save water. KCRA 3's Mike DeSalle tells us how and says there's also a tie into this to the World Cup. At first glance, the sprinklers, the puddles, the soaked Rockland soccer fields might look like water waste amid drought. It looks like it, yeah. But believe it or not, this project right here is actually a drought related project. This is to help the city save money on water. That's because what's happening right now, while it looks wet, could save 20 to 30 percent on landscape watering at these fields in the future. In short, here's what the city of Rockland and the Rockland Youth Soccer Program did. They stopped watering these fields here for four to six months, no water whatsoever, so they could rip out the old grass and then put new, more drought friendly grass in. The only drawback is they have to spend three weeks watering it. If you look at the big scheme of the project, the savings of the water up front, not watering for many months, uh, the three weeks of a little bit extra water going forward, 20 to, 20 to 30 percent less savings. In the big scheme of the project, it's an overall savings. I think it's a good idea. Oh, and we mentioned a World Cup tie in. The type of grass they are planting here. Well, Listen. This is a celebration Bermuda. This is the exact same Bermuda that's used in Brazil on the World Cup field. A piece of the World Cup, well, sort of, being planted right here in Northern California. In Rockland, Mike Tissell, KCRA 3 News. And of course, that celebration Bermuda grass doesn't plant itself. The city says a grant from Placer Valley Tourism provided the seed money.